So I'm going to do a, a, a thing on the top 10 hottest guys. 10 being, ugh, one being like, holy crap, who the hell is that dude? He is so freaking hot. Oh, MJ. Anyways, um, this is my personal one, so I, you guys can leave your comments below to tell me who's your favorite. Um, mm. <clears throat> Brendan Fraser is number 10 for me. Hugh Jackman is number 9. Jake Gyllenhaal uh, is uh, number 8. Uh, Chris Evans is number 7. Vin Diesel is number 6. Because I love Vin Diesel. Um, Robert Downey Jr. is <laughs> number 5. Sorry, I was laughing at something that I just discovered. Um, I, just written, I just wrote this on a bill. <laughs> um, <laughs> What was I saying? Rob Gunn Jr. is 5, Channing Tatum is 4, Jason Momoa is 3, and he's the, the new Conan the Barbarian, but I like him with, I, I like him with no hair here, no hair here, and no hair here. I like guys that don't have chest hair. Chest hair is just brody. Um, but I like him with long hair because I, I like guys with long hair. But you have to be able to pull it off. You, to, you can't be like fat and say like, look at my hair. No, I mean like, you have to have like this great rocking body. Anyway, uh, Bradley Cooper's number two. He won 2011 with Face Man Alive. Mm -hmm. And uh, hmm. let's see, who is number one? Oh, psh, that's an easy one. Robert Pattinson, of course. Oh, my God. oh wait. No, he's annoying and stupid and irritating. And I wouldn't use a very another unkind word, but I might offend some people. Uh, um, yes, but I have to say. Um, hmm, number one. I can't guess. I would give you five dollars if you could guess. But you probably would already know if you watched some of my other videos. Um, Chris Hemsworth, duh. Oh my freaking word! It's just long hair again. Oh wait, there's another guy with long hair that I like. <laughs> yeah. My first ever crush was, in fact, on Inigo Montoya in Princess Bride. <laughs> long hair again. <laughs> oh, okay. Conan in the Barbarian has long hair. I did like Arnold Schwarzenegger in his glory days, but now he's all old and crotchety and fat. Sylvester Stallone is the same age as him, but he looks like 10 years younger. Sylvester Stallone. They're coming out with an Expendables too. Yes. Man, this is Sylvester Stallone. He's like, I'm gonna get you. I'm the governor. You're right. Get to the trial. <laughs> yes. Anyways, um, yes. Chris Hemsworth is freaking awesome. Mm hmm. Indeed. I do have a signed poster by Robert Pattinson, though. I'm not going to go looking for it right now because I don't know where it is. And I would take about half an hour just looking for it. So I'll probably do another video with it in it. And uh, I, because I used to like uh, Twilight when I was a little girl. And then one year for my birthday, it was at my grandparents' house. And uh, all of my friends were there. And I had uh, Olivia, Erica, Hope, and Morgan on, on uh, two on this side, two on this side. And I was sitting up against the fireplace. So everybody else was in front of me, like looking at me, opening my gifts. And then my mom handed me this flat envelope. And I was like, what is it? Is it tickets or something? So I opened it and I pulled it out and I was like, <gasps> and I just like screamed. And it was him like, I forgot what the picture looks like, but it him and he signed it. And yeah, my mom ordered it because her friend lives in uh, Canada. I forgot where. And she, he was there signing autographs with Kristen Stewart and um, I got it. It was cool, but then and then I started crying. I don't know why. And then I had a cool Twilight cake. It was it was white rice crispy with an apple on top, and it said Twilight like the like it looked like a book. It was cool. Um, my grandma made it because she's like that. Um, yeah. And then everybody's like, "What, Lucky?" Like that's when everybody loved Twilight. Like all the because we were like little girls back then. And then they were like, "Oh my gosh!" <laughs> that's when we were all Team Edward. Who are you? Team Edward, who are you? Team Jacob, let's fight, you know. <laughs> we're all like serious about it. I love it. Anyways, I'll have to go find that. Yeah, so. You guys. <laughs> yeah. I was just thinking about my last video that I just did. And no, it was not on purpose. It was my high heel fail. I was all going to show you guys this like awesome head, foot behind the head stretch, but it's like twisted. Twist, more twisted. And then I went out because I forgot my seltzer water because I always drink seltzer water when I'm like starting to get sick because my, my throat is like going hoarse. 
And I came back in, I was like, so you guys, and I just, <laughs> I just ate it. So if you guys want to go look it up, it is high heel fail Katie Anderson. Because after all my videos, I put Katie Anderson just to like give it more of an engine search and um so my family can get it like that um so anyways i'm gonna go yeah i'm gonna do one a makeup mm, yeah all right bye <laughs>